anyway congratulations i was very happy to know i'm glad you got placed in the place you wanted to go right is that the yes. place you wanted to go yes ma'am yeah yes. that's right okay great i was very very happy knowing it we'll start off with where you started why did you choose to get into software development and what was your degree background yeah hi ma'am um, i am navin so i completed my btech in 2019 so later uh, i tried like uh, searching for program like a uh, full stack development program so uh, then uh, i joined in uh, j j spiders so there luckily uh, like within a one month i got a opportunity in accenture so later i moved to accenture then they i got streamed in automation testing mm-hmm. so after completing one proposed project so later i moved to manual manual projects so there i am seeing like i am working every day but i am thinking in future like where is my growth so there is no growth so every day the same work i am working so i am thinking for my growth so later i uh, check for uh, web development courses concepts then mm-hmm. later i checked in instagram so 10000 coders so the main concept they provided is the amount wise also it is very cheap compared to other organization and they provide live session so most of the organizations didn't provide live sessions they will provide the recorded sessions but here i can see the live sessions and the timings part so especially the main attractive point is timings so morning 7 am to 9 am so before also like 6 to 8 8 am some classes happen html css so the main attractive point to join uh, 10000 coders is because of the timings and the live sessions so i am also not sure like how the classes will be uh, like this is the first time i joined so it's i can say it's a risk for me only because mm-hmm. i am paying some amount i don't know like how they teach but frankly speaking uh, day from starting day one so till now till now if i need any support uh, the support is provided by 10000 coders so that's the main uh, that's the good thing and especially for classes so starting from uh, 6 am to 8 am html css classes are done thing on it got habituated and i'm now i'm very successful <laughs> because my dream job like i want to become a web developer so in a organization so the organization is also like amc company only so mm-hmm. with a good package so that's a good thing for me okay great so what was the transition like from automation to web development i mean how was it how did you feel because you went through three months of training right in yes. something you were really passionate about no doubt but how did it feel at some point you might have felt i had a job now why did i sign up for this maybe i should just go back to it it's difficult did you have any such moments and how did you overcome them uh yes and um... so while i am working in automation testing only so parallelly i used to learn uh, web development courses so mm-hmm. especially i have learned html css but coming to javascript and uh, react js so in youtube there are lot many contents are there so i can say like more than 1000 contents are there but out of 1000 so we don't know like how to follow like so which content we need to learn so like current guidance is not there so everyone have their own opinion like uh, video wise also content wise also they will covered only few content but it is very difficult to learn individually especially for freshers so yeah. currently i am also fresher fresher to react js but not to the it de- it development but it i am fresher only but uh, it is very difficult to learn uh by watching the youtube videos mm-hmm. so especially from testing background to uh web development uh, background the transition happened within a four months of period like our hard work also will play a major role so definitely i am uh, very happy because fr- this is my dream like from testing to development so because in future also we need to think not only present in future like if you work in the uh, uh, development side not only development but this is the 
uh, like hot in the market so my next question that i am curious of is you went through two three institutes right like you already studied in two places and you came to a third institute and i'm sure it was very hard for you to believe right like yes. like everyone is going to tell you know we teach good we give you job we do this we do that it's a, it's there everywhere and through instagram everyone is going to give tell yes we give placements we teach really well because they are talking about their own place but what was something special about 10000 quotas that they told you were like yeah maybe i should give it a shot because because there were two times that you already didn't it didn't work out for you really well so what was it that worked out the third time here in 10000 quotas especially for 10000 quotas so the main reason the classes were more interactive so the way he explains the concept like uh, like from non coding background students also they can easily uh, listen like easily grab the uh, concepts very quickly the main thing for me uh, like early in the morning classes so that's the best thing so mm -hmm. for the support wise also like yeah it's very it's good if you post a query like within a day the answer will come definitely okay hmm. so these are the reasons that make me to join to Okay. 10,000 quotas. Okay, great. So let's come to your curriculum. So you were from testing. You told me you're not new to IT, but you were new to web development, right? So yes. what was it like? Do you think that the training was apt? Do you think that the trainer did a good job covering all aspects of web development? Do you think it was fulfilling? So how was it for you personally? Uh, that, like what are the concepts they have uh, teach? So all concepts are very helpful. So it's a like starting step for the career, like for all the careers. Hmm. But I can say like 10,000 quarters, like they have teached very well. The concept is also the basic concept. Each and everything they have teached very well. Okay. Yeah. React.js classes. So those are very helpful. Okay. Okay. So you seem to be very happy about React.js. Is that supposed to be your favorite framework or what is it? I yeah. mean, I know people... Uh, this you're you're not the first person I'm reviewing, right? So after so many people, when I start off their session, let's say I would have handled their communication batches, and when React starts, everyone says it's so difficult. I mean, it's it's hard, like to spend a lot of time. But after say five or six months, when I come back to get their review, they'll end up telling that JavaScript and React was their favorite. So what is the reason? What is the that reason is, for the transition? This is because of Morley Saron. <laughs> Okay. okay. The main reason is because of Morley sir. Because uh, he will teach each and every concept uh, like very easy. Yeah. Like in YouTube, the same concept if we learn, it will be difficult. Like they will say something, something else, but he will teach each and every logic very simply. Okay. Like as a lesson, as a lesson, he will teach. So we don't forget also. Hmm. So that's the reason. So, because of his uh, lessons and teaching, so I learned new things also in React.js. So, because now I'm moving to organization as an experienced candidate, not a fresher. So, being an experienced candidate, so I need to learn more hmm. compared to fresher candidates. So, currently I'm in progress also. Okay, that's great. So, every day, every day learning new things. Hmm. Okay, great. So what were your training sessions like? What did it... So if you were to recall, let's say you go back in time in four months, what were your training sessions like? What did they make you feel like? So like every day, like every day we will learn new concepts. So mm -hmm. HTML, CSS, like once CSS completed, they move to JS. Mm -hmm. So JS classes, I think from starting to JS classes, no, after CSS bootstrap, so only one to one or two days classes, then JavaScript, uh, React JS. So JavaScript co coming to JavaScript and React JS. So from starting day one, so we are having the hands-on experience. So the classes taken by Morley sir. Hmm. So from starting day one till the last day, and hmm. currently now also, like if you are stuck in anywhere, like he is ready to help. So that's the main reason. Uh, like everyone will, because HTML, CSS were the basics. But mm. now coming to framework designing, so everyone needs JavaScript and React.js, not HTML and CSS. So those those mm. are basics only. Mm. 
like how we are implementing but logic wise and creating framework designing so everyone needs javascript and react js so so that's the reason everyone would like more in react js framework only okay hmm okay great nice so they gave you tasks and assignments right so what do yes, you think about those up to the mon- monitoring sessions will be there so hmm. mostly after the class i used to spend like now it is a work from home only right so that's the hmm. main uh, opportunity I, that i can save some time hmm. so because of that after the class so i will get one hour time so within hmm. one hour time like how much task i used to complete i can t- complete and in the monitoring sessions like i used to show my task so the pending task so when i ever get my free time so i used to complete great okay coming to what i am very biased at so yeah can you tell a little bit about the communication sessions were they helpful yeah communications communication classes are helpful because i know like how it like uh, you explain like how we need to write a mail in a formal way so mm-hmm. those are all things i already know because it's a everyday practice for me but mm-hmm. compared to new members so they don't know how it works hmm. so those all stuffs are very helpful for them hmm. so coming to communication classes from starting day one i attended like most of the classes hmm. like it's it's very helpful like because no one will teach these classes because if we don't know those skills like how to behave like how we need to communicate if if everyone if if no one knows these skills so after going to mnc companies so everyone will face one day a big problem like it will be helpful for each and every candidate not only for me each and every candidate it will be helpful thank you thank you navin noted i'll keep that in my mind okay moving further what was your support like was the team always there for you you already told me that they there till today like if you have any doubts and everything but you did also have stand up calls and you had to ask questions on the group so what was the overall support like so yes so from monday to friday hmm. so we are having a fixed time like evening uh, 5:30 or yeah 5:30 to 6 or uh, 4:30 to 5:30 hmm. uh, only half an hour like if we are having any doubts so we need to so most of the time uh, they fix so i'm having stand up calls so i didn't mm. get the chance to attend and so whenever i'm free definitely i, I used to attend and if i'm having any doubts so i will post in group so mm. even not only for monday to friday even in sunday also so most mm. of the times when i post the query in group so murli sir used to uh, attend and he, he he used to solve my query because he know like i am a working professional so i used to get time in on saturday and sunday only mm. so definitely he he like most of the times he used to help me like definitely i would thank to murli sir especially and uh, monitoring sessions also because they monitored very well mm. everyone everyone will say like why these monitoring classes but definitely it will help because okay. because of that monitoring classes only they used to check each and every task hmm so because of that only everyone okay they are checking they are monitoring so we need to complete our task within a day hmm okay. so that's the thing so can you give me a few insights into how it was before 10000 coders and after 10000 coders so if i were to div- divide it into two phases what would you t- tell about it yeah uh, before 10000 coders so so everyone will learn like i don't say like self learning is uh, we can't learn anything but we will learn definitely self learning is also very very important but mm. to some extent only we can able to learn because mm. in 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 it market so uh, self learning is also important but we don't know like how the market will be like for example if you consider react js so okay this is a, okay the react js is is not a framework like it's a library everyone mm. everyone thought like it's a framework but it's a library uh, and how to use those libraries and how to use those packages like by learn by self learning we can't we can't learn nothing mm. <laughs> i will definitely bet mm. because 
Hmm. Uh, in YouTube, there are a lot many contents. Like, we don't know. Like, everyone teach their own way. But, like, how to move, uh, how to move in a process where uh, no one will teach. Hmm. Then, so in 10,000 quarters, especially, like, uh, the structure wise also like they 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 teach from starting basics till react js like the framework like the designing wise each and everything in a in a like step by step process only they mm -hmm. don't skip like they didn't skip even like basic things mm -hmm. so uh, that's the main reason like uh, why 10000 quarters okay, okay great okay that's about it one last not question it's more like if i were to ask you a question of what was your entire journey with what was your entire journey with 10000 coders right what would you tell you can put that in like two or three sentences from starting day one till now like i think two weeks back only i visited 10000 coders so they hmm. are uh, their office is very near to me hmm. so two weeks back only i have visited like uh, I can say not only like if you completed your course or not, uh, and after completing your course. So if you go, if you went to office also, they are very helpful. Hmm. So if you struck anywhere like in personally, like okay, uh, I don't know like these things. If you go and ask them, so they will suggest like okay, do it in this way. Hmm. This will help in your career. So hmm. after completing the course also, like ten thousand coders will be very helpful. Uh, that's the thing I can I can uh, suggest for each and every candidate. Okay, and thank you so much for this session. Uh, I'm sure you had a really busy schedule, so you kind of made time. So that's really great. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yes, I'll end the session now. Thank you, Naveen. Have a great day. Bye. Bye bye.